Hello YouTubers, this is Anubifar. On the 2nd of April, we got a great 22 minute calling all devs about the future for the repair and refuel mechanics. Here's what you need to know about the show. Dan said that they have an overall design goal, but now they're pushing on a new UI and how the mechanics work. You'll always be able to go to the station like normal with an updated system, and that will be very basic. This new system is gonna let you choose exactly what and how much goes into what tanks. Pyro's very remote, so they expect that this will be a needed commodity and viable gameplay. Initially, they're going to simply rely on in-game chat for players to link up, but that'll become more like a service beacon in the future. They plan to use the new docking system for fuel as well. Once connected, there will be a new GUI to make trade and BAM simple fuel transfer. They're messing around with managing the pressure balances between tanks, and I guess that could be fun gameplay. They also plan to make it take time to get fuel. They said maybe 20 or 30 seconds, and they've reminded us a second time that they can't release Pyro without fuel mechanics because of how that system is laid out within lore. Dan said that a rookie player can totally mess up fuel transfer, resulting in venting or even a catastrophic result, and that is the risk-reward of gameplay. Dan stopped there and Jared got Johnny. Johnny tackled some of the planned repair mechanics. Initially, a repair is planned to release as a magic beam that you can aim and suck up material and then reverse the flow and then point the magic beam at the hull to regenerate health. They plan to make this process visually accurate for the players so you'll be able to see the process. You can also choose to simply buy the repair goop if you don't feel like collecting it yourself. You will never get the ship back to showroom perfect. Jared confirmed that repair and salvage initially is just the same mechanic but in reverse. But then Johnny said, like everything in Star Citizen is not that simple and it's going to get fleshed out as we traverse from tier 0 to complete the game loop. Johnny ended that now is definitely the right time to push these changes as persistence is becoming more reliable and a great starting point. And that's it. Thanks very much for spending your time with me. Fly safe and I'll see you in the verse.